Hey guys, what's up? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today's video is what I'm getting the girls for Christmas, what I'm getting my kids for Christmas video. I am sitting down to film this while Emerson is taking a nap because she will see and remember these things. And Charlie is chilling here in the crib, not so quietly, with a snack. We'll see how this goes. Start off with, my goal is to link everything below. If there is any kind of discount code or discount that I know of, I will put it on the screen so that you guys know about it. So this is the first of a couple videos that I have coming up when it comes to gifting. I saw a lot of feedback on Instagram from people wanting ideas, so I've decided to make an ultimate like toddler gift guide, things that I've gifted the girls in the past, things that we have and love. But if you want those ideas now and you don't wanna wait, I have a link down below to my Amazon shop, which has most of the items that I will be sharing and talking about. You can go there and shop from that. I have almost 100 different ideas. Ideas. The last video I plan on making after this video is a stocking stuffer video. So many cute ideas. So excited to share those. Before I get into it, be sure to hit subscribe so you can come back and catch those. So like I said, it is early. I tried to wait as long as I could so I could show you physical items, but I do have a couple things that are coming in the mail. Okay, so the very first item, and this is something that Emerson has already had out and played with because it's more of like a winter item, although I do think it would make a great Christmas gift. This is from a little Etsy shop called Natural Playbox, and this is the holiday edition. I know that there's only a few of these left, but she does do other seasons, and there are several other there are cute items on her shop if you want to look around. The goal of this box is to cultivate a child's natural desire to learn. There's little wooden snowflakes. There's several bells. Emerson loves to line things up. Um, we like to count out things. We kind of made our own little designs out of certain things in the box. There's little stars, several cinnamon sticks. We'll count the items. She'll line things up from like biggest to smallest. Comes with either a magnifying glass or a set of tongs. Again, this is one of my favorite all year round items, but they do have a winter holiday edition. So kind of on the Montessori kick while we're here, I've got several items for both of the girls from a company called Plan Toys. I love this company. They have so many cute ideas on Amazon and on their shop. These are all sustainable play toys. They're all made from chemical free ingredients. They're all little wooden toys. First item that I got for Emerson is this little vegetable garden, a little wheelbarrow. How stinking cute. Several little rows and these little vegetables that she can play with and plant and water. Look at this carrot. Is this not like, this is just so much fun. I can't wait, I'm so excited. And the other one that I thought would be fun for Emerson is the jumping acrobat. I would love to take this out and show you, but I don't have that much time. A little wooden guy that sits inside of there and you can adjust the height of the top. Here it shows you on the back. But you hit the bottom piece and he flies up and he's got a little magnet in his head and he'll catch the top. It's a cause and effect toy. It's a fine motor toy. It's a coordination toy. I can see us playing with this on Christmas morning or just having it around and he's gonna think this is hilarious. So also from them I picked out this little kazoo. Um, both of the girls love musical items. Charlie specifically. I love that Charlie's just standing here watching me. Next up is a toy for Charlie. This is another sustainable toy. This is a little wooden drum and it comes with a rubber mallet. It makes different sounds depending on where you hit it on the drum. This Charlie loves everything drum related. So I was looking for something that would be fun to have around, but also something that she can kind of learn from. That's why I like this one. Next is another Emerson toy. This is a little ballerina. Um, it has a string that you thread around and you pull it and she spins like a little top. I feel like Christmas should have little random trinkets like this. Another cause and effect coordination using your hands fun toy that Emmy gets to play with. Are you gonna sit right there and play? All right, next up for Emerson, another brand of toys that I love. This is a brand called Green Toys and what I love about them is that they're made from all recycled and all organic material. They're really durable, they're great bath toys. They have several bath toys and those are on my list too, my Amazon list. If you have a Marshall or a Home Goods or a TJ Maxx near you, they always have the best prices on Green Toys. Amazon also runs really great deals on them. Emerson loves cooking, pretend cooking, real cooking, any kind of cooking. So for her, I found this cupcake set. Going along with that, I also have been looking for. Going along with that, I've also been waiting for Christmas to purchase this dish set for her. Going along with the baking theme is actually something that is on Amazon that has not yet arrived, and that is this apron. I thought this was the cutest one for Emerson. It was also the best price that I found. To go along with that all, I got this little baking set from the Dollar Spot in Target. It's a set of utensils for her, as well as some little uh, silicone or rubber um, what are these called? Muffin cupcake things? Charlie J. Nunez. <laughs> we could use this to actually bake together, or I feel like this would be great to put in with her sensory toys and she can play with beans or with the little water beads or whatever she wants to with this set. 
So speaking of sensory things, one of the things that I ordered on Amazon for both of the girls are these Orbeez water beads. I've seen them on so many different like toddler activity sites on Pinterest all the time. I used them for the first time a few months ago. They are so much fun. They're perfect winter indoor activities. I think it was like six dollars for a huge tub of them on Amazon. Again, linked below. Right now, Emerson is really into Disney princesses, but I think you can't go wrong getting books. So I decided to combine the two things of the princesses and the books. She has a princess book set that she loves to read with daddy before bed. I thought that I would give them something new to go through. Each page has flaps that you lift and you have to find things. This was a TJ Maxx find. They have great books there. Usually an okay deal. Sometimes Amazon will have better deals than they do. So Emerson's bigger gift. If you know anything about Emerson, she is absolutely obsessed with her baby sister. Oh my goodness. If she wasn't two, I would almost trust her to babysit Charlie. She loves babies so much. She has a couple random little baby dolls, but I wanted to get her one that was like her her baby doll. You know what I mean? So I picked up this baby Annabelle for Emerson at Target. I wanted one that could do several different things. So with this doll, it comes with a bottle to feed her. It also has like a diaper, a potty for her. I am so excited. After I bought this, a friend of ours asked Emmy what she wanted for Christmas and she said a pink doll. She is going to be so stinking excited. So go along with baby Annabelle here. I scoured the internet for a good deal on one of these strollers. They have several on Etsy. If you've ever looked for one of these like wooden strollers, you'll know that they range from about $50 to $150. Find one on Amazon that is very similar to this one if you're looking. But if you live near a Home Goods or if you live near a Marshalls, I highly suggest going in and looking. That is where I found this stroller and this was $25. The better deal was that this stroller happens to be missing two screws on this side. So this is obviously loose right now, but I know how to put a screw in. So I asked them um, if they could bring the price down for that and they gave it to me for $17. So I was so excited. My original $100 to $150 one that I found, I got down to finding one that I like just as much for $17 and that is a huge win. To go along with this, I found a matching little crib, but I decided to go with the pink one because I thought that's what Emmy would like. She's gonna freak out. All she wants to be is a mom. Probably just discovered she can make spit bubbles and that's what that noise is. Apparently she was doing more than spit bubbles. This was one of the stocking stuffers that I got in the dollar section at Target. Probably figured out how to pull it open. All right, so I'm gonna run through these last things hopefully quicker and then I'll show you the big elephant in the room. Definitely hit up the Target dollar section this year. Highly recommend. I found these lacing shapes. I love these little lacing activities. They had, I think, a Santa Claus and different ones. I went with the police officers, I think. One of the things that I wanted to find for Charlie were magnets, larger magnets that she could play with on the fridge. Um, I found this Melissa and Doug animal set at Home Goods as well, but they have this on Amazon. 20 wooden animal magnets in here that she's gonna have so much fun with. From Old Navy, these are probably gonna be a stocking stuffer. Got Charlie these little um, booties. Our downstairs is really cold and the girls have problem with keeping their socks on, so I thought I'll throw these booties on her downstairs. I grabbed a gray and a pink pair for her. Up next for Charlie, Charlie found another one of her presents. And those are these Skip Hop Snap Cups. of different animals. Um, it's great for on the go because this cap like closes and locks down like that um, And if you can see they have to reach in there and grab their snacks. I got the little narwhal and a Little giraffe isn't that so stinking cute it has a handle on there as well great for the zoo or just on the go snacks one of the very first things that I put on my list of things for Charlie was some form of cars one of her favorite things is just little push toys or car toys. She loves playing with them, driving them back and forth, sliding them down things. So I grabbed her this little mini vehicle set from Green Toys. It just gives us four more cars for her to have around. These can go in the bath. We have a couple in the bath already. I'm excited to bust these out with her. Also from the Target dollar section, not a gift, but they had some really cute wrapping paper. Charlie being 13 months, and one of her big things that she's working on right now is learning how to feed herself. Um, and she has these tools that I actually got and we're already using, but they would be a great Christmas present from Ryan and Rose. You can find them on Amazon. There's a picture right here. Um, they're great for gripping for little baby hands. They have a better grip on them. The problem that I usually have is that Charlie likes to throw her bowl. So one of the things that I found that I've heard great things about from many friends of mine are these easy peasy place mats. And this is the happy mat from them. 
I actually have a code for you from this company. This placemat is a placemat and a plate in one. It suction cups down on the table. Um, they have smaller versions of these if you want to use them for um, like on the go to throw in your diaper bag if you're eating at a restaurant. Okay. Yes, you will share this with Charlie. But <laughs> these are dishwasher and microwave safe, so they're really easy to clean off. I'm really excited to start using this. Definitely smaller versions or just bowl versions. If you want to go look around their website, if you guys are even listening anymore with the distraction in the background. Oh my goodness. So I just filmed an outro. I totally almost forgot. I have a couple more things coming. Emerson, if you've seen recent videos, loves, they have this song in her preschool class that they sing about the weather and they talk about the weather a lot. So she's been really interested in the weather. I found her this weather board from Moon Picnic. I'll put it right here. Um, it is so cute. She can go through and set what the weather is, what the temperature is. I'm gonna hang that in her room. So much fun. Also, when it comes to sensory items, I ordered another round of pom-poms. We use pom-poms every day. The favorite present of last Christmas for like scooping, for playing in different situations. She pretend cooks with the pom-poms. Pom -poms. We love pom poms, so I thought I would upgrade her pom poms a little bit. Two last things that I forgot to mention is this Learning Resources Bird in a Nest Sorting Kit. It's got little nests with little different, um, they're small little birds, like a color matching, sorting, organizing um, activity. So, going along with the color matching and the kitchen play is this farmer's market um, food set from Learning Resources. The girls love playing with their little kitchen over here. They will be excited to have more food in the kitchen. We don't really have that many like food items right now. The big reveal. What is this called, Em? Do you know what this is called? Bloxy. Bloxy. Yeah. Thank you, Santa. Thank you, Santa. <laughs> so we had this out earlier because I am doing a giveaway of a Bloxy on my Instagram. We had to photograph it the other day. I told the girls that we were borrowing this Bloxy and hopefully if we were good, Santa would bring them on for Christmas. Definitely a more splurge Christmas gift idea. When I first started thinking about Christmas presents for the girls, my thought was what do they each like what is their favorite thing for emerson it was babies baby dolls for charlie charlie is a climber she loves climbing up on things she's obsessed with our couch um she loves to just run back and forth on the back of our couch and jump as much as she can so i thought how can i get something for charlie that's related to couches and play when i came across this on instagram i was like this is absolutely perfect when i looked into them more i found out that they are a company from indiana which is awesome because I am from Indiana. So I'm really excited to be supporting this small family run company from Indiana. Um, there's actually a very similar company called Nugget out there if you've seen. So apparently Nugget is already sold out for Christmas and you can't buy one. Pretty sure that the Bloxy and the Nugget are the exact same price. There's just some small differences. The biggest one being that the Bloxy is actually available for purchase right now. I think the Nugget might be a little bit smaller, but it is covered in a fabric that you can take off and wash. And then this is made of a vinyl material. To me, the vinyl seemed like a much better option because I can just wipe it down and disinfect it a lot easier. As you guys can see, it makes a great slide, but there's also so many other options. You could turn it into a fort. We've thrown blankets over it. At the end of the day, it folds up and it sits here as a couch for the girls. This is a great like gift for any kid, honestly, any age to grow up. It'll still be just as fun. It is a splurge, but like I said, if you're looking for a larger item that's lasting and that you can get a lot of use out of and a great way to spend your time during the, the winter months. This guy. But Black Friday I think will probably be the best time to snag this. They have a sale going on. On top of that sale I have $10 off for any of my followers with the code here on the screen. Like I said I am going to be posting another ultimate gift guide for toddlers and babies if you like these ideas. I've got a lot of similar ideas and more ideas. YouTube probably has my comments off but you can go over to my Instagram and leave a comment on my most recent post. What are some of your favorite items that you are gifting this year? Um, thank you guys so much for watching and again for supporting my channel and making it possible for me to bring you these videos. I hope you guys have a happy holidays and hopefully you can find some good deals or some good ideas from this gift guide. We love you so much. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Happy holidays.